Hey, you guys, we are back once again for story time from my bedroom. I can't let it go, y'all. Come on in the room. That's not the craziest ass singing that. I can't let that good times tune go, okay? <laughs> you guys, before we get started, go ahead and subscribe to the channel. I got some new subscribers. I'm over 1,200 subscribers now. So shout out to the new subscribers. Thank you for the support. And I hope you guys are enjoying the video. Go ahead and subscribe to the channel. Click the bell for notifications. And then go ahead and give the video a thumbs up. And share the video so some other people can watch story time from my bedroom. Come on in the room. Don't let me quit. Y'all, you see it's light outside, so I got started early today because <clears throat> it is snowing ice here in uh, Ohio, and so I have to go out here and dig my car out or at least scrape some of the ice off because I have to go to work in the morning, and if I don't do some of it tonight, it's going to be like an ice box tomorrow. I'm not going to be able to do anything. I'm not going to be able to make it to work. Okay, so I told you guys we was going to talk about Tracy and her now later story. Oh my God. Let me tell you something. I ain't the only one that's petty. Tracy ain't the only one that's petty. Baron is the king of pettiness, honey. The king, and it just trickled down to us. So here's the story about Tracy and the now laters. If you've been watching my videos and you've <clears throat> been keeping up with everything, I told you that we, me and my sister and us, we used to eat candy. That's what we got filled up on uh, during our teenage years, mainly just junk food. And so we did that because my dad was an alcoholic, you guys, and he used to spend his money on liquor and beer and stuff. And the only thing mainly that we ate most, 95% of the time, was beans. So we got tired of eating beans, so we would buy candy. You know, candy is a filler. I'm not saying that it's good, but candy is a filler. So I have my little candy that I would eat. Now, I like all kinds of candies. Candies, cookies, chips, pop, whatever, ice cream. <clears throat> Tracy's drug of choice <laughs> was now and laters. Tracy loved us now laters. Honey, I don't know. It was any kind of pineapple, tropical punch, uh, uh, watermelon, tray, bubble gum, vanilla, chocolate. Tracy loved her some now laters. And everybody knew that Tracy loved now laters. Bear knew that Tracy loved now laters. So whenever Tracy would get on a punishment, guess what her punishment was, y'all? She couldn't eat no now laters. What kind of punishment is that? You're trying to hurt somebody's soul. I know when somebody's trying to injure somebody's soul, like take everything from me, but not my freaking now laters. Really, you're trying to starve me to death because that's the source of my supply. <laughs> so here's the story for this one, you guys. Back in the day, you could take pop bottles. I don't think they got pop bottles no more. Not unless you see like some nostalgic type Coca-Cola or Pepsi bottles. But um, pop like Pepsi used to come in pop bottles. And so my mom would get her. She loved her some Pepsi, honey. Pepsi generation. She should have been in a commercial. She loved Pepsi. And so what she would do is she would get her Pepsis and she always had like this little paper crate or what have you, um, you know, that you can carry your Pepsis in. And she would go ahead and save up her bottles. Now, a thing of Pepsi costs 50 cents. Back in the day, day y'all. So it cost 50 cents for some Pepsi. And so she would get six pop bottles. Eventually she would save up. You know, she would get multiple pops and then she had a carton. What we call a carton of pop bottles. So the deal with the pop bottles was you had to clean them out. They couldn't have no roaches. They couldn't have no bugs in them. They couldn't have like syrup in them. So she would clean the, you know, the inside of the bottles or whatever. And then you take it on around to the store and get something else. So you got 60 cent with six pop bottles. So she asked Tracy this time to go to the store. Oh, and it's so crazy that I'm telling this story on today because I was supposed to tell her Wednesday, but I didn't for some reason. It's snowing outside and it's icing outside. Perfect. Look at the time and all that. Look at God. <laughs> so Tracy, she asked, she told Tracy, go around to the store, to, uh, go around the corner to the dirty store. Remember the dirty store was on the corner, man, stuck in there. Go around the corner to the dirty store and buy me a Pepsi and then you can have the change. So the change would be 10 cents. Guess how much now ladies was? 10 cents, honey. 
<laughs> so Tracy go and walk around slowly to the store and get, you know, uh, cash it in and get um, the Pepsi. And then she got her a pack of now laters. Now, pause right there. This is my mom, how she used to make her pops cold, honey. You had to be a kind of uh, a Pepsi baby to know this type of trickery. So my mama, since it was snowing outside, she would take her pop, not stick it in the freezer, but you know how you get a pop out the out the uh, uh, thing, the free the what you call that, the ice box, the refrigerator thing at the store. If you get the one in the front, it ain't really that cold, so you try to dig to the back. But at the dirty store, the pop was behind the counter, so you couldn't get it. He just reached and get the first one. So she wanted hers freezing cold, honey. She wanted that when she drank her thok, honey, was burnt like this. <sighs> when you done took your breath. <laughs> What's the excitement of you losing your breath from acid flowing down your throat, eating up your stomach lining? Who the thrill of it all, honey? <laughs> she wanted her thok to burn. So she would take her Pepsi and put it on the ledge outside, you guys. Stick it down in the snow on the ledge and let it sit there for like an hour or two. Then she would crack that sucker open. And every time I heard that, here I come down the step. Can I get a sweet? <laughs> on the swig of that cold Pepsi. <laughs> so my throat <laughs> could burn. <laughs> You guys, you guys, I'm back. I don't know why I thought that was just so funny. I just wasn't going to laugh in y'all face talking about my throat burning. And here I am drinking tea because I got like a little slight tickle in my throat. That's from years of Pepsi drinking, baby. Them burnt my esophagus and can now. So Tracy go around to the store. So back in the 80s, y'all, we got snow. This stuff we get now, honey, by the time it hit wintertime, you was getting snow. You was getting like 10, 12 inches of snow and the schools did not close so tracy's treading through snow we ain't talking about no one or two inches we talking about four five six inches worth of snow with ice up underneath it and so my mama hanging out the window honey anticipating tracy coming back from the store so tracy coming back from the store y'all and she got my mama pepsi in a in a bag in a probably a paper bag and she has her, her pack of now laters in there. Tracy gets, like, I can vision the building we lived in. It had a little set of steps. Tracy got to the people right next door. It was this red brick house that was right next to us, and it had a black gate on it. Tracy got right there, and my mama's in the window, and Tracy slipped because those people next door with the black gate had a, um, what is it? It's a pipe a metal pipe that ran down when it used to rain, the water would come through the, you know, through the pipe and kind of flush into the street. Well, the pipe didn't come all the way to the street, but you know, it's by the side of the house and it would pour into the street. Now, mind you, it's a whole slick patch of ice now because the snow is melting and then it's coming down. Tracy slipped on this patch of ice. Baby, Tracy went up in the air. You ever see them? <laughs> yellow size that they got at the stores when say don't slip and fall and the person was like Wah! that was Tracy Tracy went up in the air so my mama's like Tracy she go up in the air honey feet up like a paraplegic bag went this away Tracy caught, held on to the bag but she fell down and broke my mama. Well, she didn't break my mama Pepsi. My mama Pepsi bottle broke. I don't know if my mama was concerned about Tracy or she was more concerned about that Pepsi. Because my mama struggled. We were struggling financial wise. So it must have been if she cashing in pop bottles. Well, no more food stamps left around there. And so this was her last. Well, no more pop bottles in that house. Baby, Tracy get up disheveled once again. <laughs> I looked it up, y'all. Disheveled is a word. Disheveled once again. She picks the bag up. Now, sometimes when you drop something, if you got the cap on it, they'll replace it. No, this thing was shattered. So Tracy just 
left the bag outside. I think she picked it up to put it like in a garbage can or something. And her landlady was still in there. So she comes upstairs and she's like, I failed. My mama had seen it or whatever. Honey, when I tell you, y'all raggedy daddy. This y'all daddy too, y'all. I've been telling y'all about him. This y'all daddy too. Y'all ain't gonna put that man on me only. So y'all daddy bear come into the kitchen. Now, mind you, when my mama hollered, Tracy, Baron came to the window and looked, seen Tracy on the floor. Tracy come up to the second floor where the, where the kitchen area was, where my mama's bedroom was. Honey, didn't nobody ask Tracy if she was all right? Didn't nobody say, is you fine? Did you get cut? Did you hurt yourself? It's okay. Y'all, the first thing Bear said out of his mouth was, you dropped that pop, but you show sure caught them now, ladies. <laughs> oh, to God, I can't make this up. He said, you drop your mama pop, let that break, but you ain't let them now, ladies, break, did you? And snatched the now, ladies, out of Tracy's hand. Honey, when I tell you, Tracy came upstairs, honey, cried, honey. Tracy was crying, baby. You would have thought her bestest friend had died. I'm like, what's wrong? She was like, I fell and dropped the pop. And then Baron gonna say, you, you gonna drop that pop, let that break, but you cop them now, ladies. And she was like, by this time, she's hysterical, y'all. <laughs> by now, ladies. I was on dinner. I said, what? I'm laughing now, y'all. At that time, I was so pissed. Like, how can you be mad at her? This was not her fault. This was a act of nature. The thing slid. You should have went and got the pot for your wife or what have you. You didn't check on her. See when she was okay. So she's crying because she's probably hurt physically, honey. Tracy fell, fell. Like, you know how you fall. <laughs> you can like stumble a little bit far, but Tracy fell, went up, honey. And you know how you land on your back. That junk hurts on ice. And then you come up there instead of coming to the house and instead of saying that you okay, you t you saying some old petty. Honey, next thing you know, bear call Tracy. No. Next thing you know, y'all daddy called, <laughs> call him daddy, y'all daddy called Tracy downstairs. Baby, I wish, I ain't even gonna do it. I would lay up in my bed and show you because I can picture him laying in the bed because he laid in the bed that same way all the time. Bear never wore a shirt. Bear, I have his, uh, he would just have his drawers on. You know, we ain't had money for PJs. That, that was a luxury, honey. What's a PJ? What's pajamas? So Bear had his little box of drawers or whatever. So what he would do is twist his drawers to the side. So, you know, we, you know, stuff you don't want to see nothing. So he laid in the bed on the side. Boo Snoo, come in here. That's her nickname, Boo. Boo Snoo, come in here. Y'all. Hold on, because we, we ain't going to do this. Hold, hold on, hold on. Y'all, this Baron, say this now. Lady. Boo Snoo. Boy, if I'm lying, check the comments. Tracy going to watch this video. Check the comments and tell and Tracy, tell them if this ain't true. Boo Snoo. Drop your mom pop. You can't drop her now, you. Y'all. My teeth blue now. I hate blue candy. He ate them now, ladies. And Tracy faced to torture her. Tracy was <laughs> Tracy was sick. Tracy was just it ain't even words. What's what, what, let me think of a word I can think of. Flabbergasted. Tracy was a flabbergasted. He ate her now, ladies, y'all, in her face, chewing, smacking. And let me tell you something about Bear. I promise you, I promise you, Bear didn't eat no sugar. Bear didn't eat sweets. 
He chewed them down ladies in her face. And Tracy just left. She ain't had no dinner because she wasn't going to eat no beans. Y'all, that man is the pettiest person ever over a pack of now ladies. Now, real man, y'all daddy, if he was a real man, he would have had some extra money to go buy your wife another pop. And matter of fact, since you want to make sure your wife get it, take your tail around that corner and go buy your wife a pop. Now, mind you, my mama never said nothing else about it. It just, there's no way to do that. Just said nothing else about it, but he took it to a whole nother torturous, honey, level with Tracy. Y'all, he ate the noun laters in Tracy face to be funny. Ooh, get y'all daddy. <laughs> Evilness. Evilness. Tracy came back upstairs crying. Her feelings was just her. She was already upset because she, she knew my mama didn't have no more money to get no pop. But that right there just, ooh, what they say, insult to injury, to add salt to the wound, honey. He just played it. Y'all, that's the story time for my baby. Come on in, baby. <laughs> Tracy, I'm going to get you some now, ladies. Girl. So now, honey. Tracy got her as a good old job, baby. Benefits and everything. She gets now ladies whenever she wants now ladies, honey. <laughs> Tracy buy now ladies by the pounds, baby. <laughs> oh my God, that's Tracy now ladies story, y'all. You guys, I appreciate you guys for tuning in with these super crazy stories. We'll have some more crazy stories for you next week, you guys. You guys have a great weekend. It is Friday. Let me know if it's snowing where you at. I know there's one lady on here. She live in Alaska, so I know it's snowing where y'all at. They probably buried up underneath the snow. But shout out to where you're at if you want to. And then tell me if it's snowing there. I think we're supposed to get... Maybe two to three, four to five, but ours is just ice. Like, it's literally raining ice. It's been raining ice for hours, and they did not treat the streets. So, you guys, go ahead. I wish it was a now later emoji <laughs> for tracing her trauma. <laughs> you guys, go ahead and subscribe to the channel. Click the bell for notifications and give the video a thumbs up. And also follow me on Instagram, TikTok, and Facebook under I Love to Giggle Too. I think I'm going to, someone had gave a suggestion of me doing a story time or maybe Instagram or something like that. I may do a story time, a special story time on IG, uh, maybe next week. Let's do that next week. I'll let you know, or maybe I'll plan it out and I'll make sure I put it and post it so everybody can kind of tune in. Okay, you guys, good talking to you. Have a great weekend and be safe. Bye.